in the intricate tapestry of human habits and routines. The choice of sleep position emerges as a seemingly mundane yet profoundly influential aspect of daily life. For centuries, individuals have varied in their sleeping preferences, with some favoring one position over another. Whether it's sleeping on one's back, stomach, or either side, each posture reflects not just a physical inclination, but also deeper subconscious tendencies and cultural influences. The introduction of our exploration delves into the significance of this seemingly simple choice, setting the stage for a deeper investigation into the practice of sleeping on the left side, particularly within the context of Buddhist tradition. By acknowledging the diversity of sleep positions and their potential impacts on physical health, mental well-being, and spiritual alignment, we pave the way for a more holistic understanding of sleep as a fundamental aspect of human experience. Furthermore, the introduction highlights the universality of the human experience of sleep, transcending cultural, geographical, and temporal boundaries. It acknowledges that while sleep habits may vary across different cultures and historical periods, the underlying motivations and implications remain worthy of exploration and reflection. As we embark on this journey of discovery, we invite viewers to contemplate their own sleep habits and the potential significance behind their preferred positions. By fostering curiosity and open-mindedness, we lay the groundwork for a deeper exploration of the wisdom embedded within the practice of sleeping on the left side, as informed by Buddhist teachings and traditions. As the evening descends upon the tranquil Buddhist monastery nestled among the mist-covered mountains of Japan, the revered monk Shinzo emerges as a beacon of wisdom and enlightenment. Within the sacred confines of the monastery's main hall, disciples gather eagerly, their hearts and minds open to receive the profound teachings that Shinzo is poised to impart. With a serene countenance and a gentle yet commanding presence, Shinzo takes his seat on a tatami mat, surrounded by flickering lanterns that cast a soft glow upon his visage. The air is charged with a sense of anticipation as disciples settle into a reverent silence, eager to drink from the wellspring of Shinzo's knowledge. In his resonant voice, Shinzo begins to speak, his words flowing like a tranquil stream, carrying with them the weight of centuries of contemplation and spiritual insight. Dear disciples, begins tonight. We shall delve into the profound wisdom of left-sided sleep and explore its myriad benefits for body, mind, and spirit with eloquence and clarity. Shinzo elucidates the physiological and spiritual principles that underpin the practice of sleeping on the left side. He explains how this ancient tradition aligns with the holistic worldview of Buddhism, which recognizes the interconnectedness of all aspects of existence. Shinzo guides his disciples on a journey of exploration, delving into the intricate workings of the human body and the ways in which left-sided sleep optimizes physiological functions. He elucidates how this sleeping posture promotes optimal lymphatic drainage, facilitates digestion, and enhances cardiovascular health, among other benefits. But Shinzo's teachings extend far beyond the realm of the physical body with profound insight. He reveals how left-sided sleep fosters a deeper connection to the spiritual dimensions of existence. He speaks of the alignment of the body's energy channels, the harmonization of yin and yang energies, and the cultivation of inner peace and serenity. As Shinzo's discourse unfolds, his disciples are enraptured, hanging on his every word and drinking deeply from the wellspring of wisdom that he offers. They are inspired to reflect on their own sleep habits and to consider the profound implications of aligning themselves with the natural rhythms of the universe. Through Shinzo's guidance, the disciples come to understand that left-sided sleep is not merely a physical practice, but a sacred ritual, an opportunity to align body, mind, and spirit with the universal flow of life. They leave the main hall with hearts and minds uplifted, carrying with them the transformative teachings of their revered teacher. In the serene ambience of the Buddhist monastery, 
amidst the whispered rustle of bamboo leaves and the gentle trickling of a nearby stream. Shinzo's teachings delve deeper into the intricate workings of the human body, focusing specifically on the phenomenon of lymphatic drainage, with a voice that carries the weight of centuries of wisdom. Shinzo begins to elucidate the profound significance of lymphatic drainage, the body's internal river of purification and vitality. Dear disciples, he intones, let us journey inward to explore the sacred river that flows within each of us, the lymphatic system. As Shinzo speaks, his disciples listen with rapt attention, their minds open to receive the timeless truths that he imparts. He explains how the lymphatic system serves as a vital network of vessels and nods, carrying lymph, a clear fluid rich in immune cells and waste products, throughout the body. In the ancient wisdom of our tradition, Shinzo continues, the left side of the body is revered as the guardian of this sacred flow. He elaborates on how sleeping on the left side creates an optimal pathway for lymphatic drainage likening it to a gentle river that meanders gracefully through the landscape of the body. Shinzo paints a vivid picture of the lymphatic system's role in maintaining health and vitality, likening it to the life-giving waters of a nourishing river. He explains how sleeping on the left side facilitates the free flow of lymph, allowing the body to rid itself of toxins and waste products, much like a river carries away debris downstream. But Shinzo's teachings go beyond mere physiology. With insight born of deep spiritual contemplation, he reveals the symbolic significance of lymphatic drainage, a metaphor for the purification and renewal of the soul. He speaks of the importance of aligning oneself with the natural rhythms of the body, allowing the river of lymph to flow unimpeded, and in doing so, fostering a sense of inner harmony and balance as Shinzo's discourse unfolds, his disciples are captivated by the depth of his wisdom and the beauty of his metaphors. They come to understand that lymphatic drainage is not just a physical process, but a sacred dance, a harmonious interplay of body, mind, and spirit. With newfound reverence for the inner workings of their bodies, the disciples depart from Shinzo's teachings, their hearts and minds enriched by the profound insights he has shared. And as they drift off to sleep that night, they do so with a newfound awareness of the sacred river that flows within them, carrying them ever closer to enlightenment. In the hallowed halls of the Buddhist monastery, illuminated by the soft glow of lanterns and the tranquil aura of spiritual reverence, Shinzo's teachings weave a tapestry of wisdom that extends beyond the physical realm and into the depths of the human experience. With a gentle demeanor and a profound understanding of the body's inner workings, Shinzo embarks on a journey to explore the intricate dance of the organs during sleep, particularly focusing on the harmony that emerges when one slumbers on their left side. As we embark on this journey of introspection, Shinzo begins, his voice carrying a serene resonance that commands the attention of his disciples. Let us delve into the wondrous choreography that unfolds within the body during the sacred act of sleep. With each word, Shinzo peels back the layers of complexity that shroud the human digestive system, shedding light on the delicate interplay between the stomach and pancreas, the custodians of our internal temple. Picture if you will, the stomach and pancreas as celestial dancers, moving in graceful synchrony to orchestrate the symphony of digestion, Shinzo muses, his words imbued with a sense of reverence for the body's innate wisdom. He elucidates how sleeping on the left side creates a sacred space, a veritable stage, for this divine performance to unfold. When we lie on our left side, Shinzo explains, we offer a sanctuary for the stomach and pancreas to execute their duties with utmost grace and efficiency. It is as if we are inviting these noble organs to partake in a celestial ballet, where each movement is infused with purpose and poise. As Shinzo delves deeper into the intricacies of gastric harmony, 
His disciples hang on his every word, their minds alight with newfound understanding. They come to realize that the act of sleeping on the left side is not merely a matter of physical comfort, but a profound gesture of reverence for the body's internal divinity. With each passing moment, Shinzo's teachings resonate more deeply within the hearts of his disciples, inspiring them to cultivate a deeper connection with their own bodily rhythms as they reflect on the divine choreography that unfolds within them each night. They are filled with a sense of awe and gratitude for the miraculous workings of the human form. And as they drift off to sleep that night, their bodies cradled in the gentle embrace of the left side, they do so with a newfound appreciation for the sacred dance of the organs, a dance that continues to unfold night after night in perfect harmony with the rhythms of the universe. In the tranquil sanctum of the monastery, bathed in the soft glow of flickering candlelight, Shinzo's teachings on the profound benefits of left-sided sleep continue to captivate his devoted disciples. With each revelation, the disciples find themselves drawn deeper into the mystical realm of the body's nocturnal rituals, particularly the profound process of internal purification that unfolds during sleep. With a serene expression and an aura of wisdom that seems to emanate from the very core of his being, Shinzo delves into the intricate mechanisms that govern the body's purification rituals, unveiling the hidden mysteries that lie dormant within the depths of the human form. Consider, if you will, the body as a sacred temple. Shinzo begins, his voice carrying a melodic cadence that resonates with reverence. Just as a temple requires regular purification to maintain its sanctity, so too does the body require a nightly ritual of internal cleansing to rid itself of accumulated toxins and impurities. As Shinzo speaks, his disciples listen intently, hanging on his every word as he unravels the secrets of the body's nocturnal purification process. He explains how sleeping on the left side facilitates the free flow of digestive waste through the intestines likening it to a gentle stream meandering through fertile soil, carrying with it the detritus of the day's consumption. In the quiet stillness of the night, as the body rests and rejuvenates, a silent ceremony of purification unfolds. Shinzo continues, his words imbued with a sense of reverence for the sacredness of the body's innate wisdom. With each breath, each heartbeat, the body works tirelessly to cleanse itself of toxins, purifying the soul as it slumbers. The disciples listen in rapt attention, their hearts filled with a sense of wonder at the miraculous workings of the human form. They come to understand that the act of sleeping on the left side is not merely a matter of physical comfort, but a sacred ritual that honors the body's natural rhythms and fosters a profound sense of inner purification as Shinzo's teachings resonate within them. The disciples feel a deep sense of gratitude for the body's innate wisdom and an overwhelming desire to cultivate a deeper connection with their own internal processes. And as they drift off to sleep that night, their bodies cradled in the gentle embrace of the left side, they do so with a newfound appreciation for the sacred ritual of internal purification, a ritual that continues to unfold night after night, in perfect harmony with the rhythms of the universe. In the hushed serenity of the monastery hall, Shinzo's discourse on the profound significance of left-sided sleep unfolds, drawing his disciples into the sacred realm of the heart's embrace. With each word, Shinzo illuminates the intricate dance between body and spirit, revealing the deep connection between sleep position and the nurturing of the seat of life. The heart. The heart. Dear disciples is the very essence of our being. Shinzo begins, his voice resonating with reverence and wisdom. It is the sacred vessel that sustains the flame of life within us, pulsating with the rhythm of our existence. As the disciples listen intently, Shinzo delves into the physiological and spiritual implications of sleeping on the left side, 
highlighting its profound effects on the heart's well-being. He explains how the left side of the body offers a perfect backdrop for the heart's work, allowing it to function with greater ease and efficiency. When we sleep on the left side, Shinzo continues, we create a harmonious environment for the heart to carry out its vital functions. The natural curvature of the spine and the positioning of the heart on the left side of the chest reduce pressure on this vital organ, promoting optimal blood circulation and easing the burden on the cardiovascular system. The disciples nod in understanding, their hearts filled with gratitude for the wisdom that Shinzo imparts. They come to realize that sleeping on the left side is not just a physical act, but a profound gesture of reverence for the seat of life within them. With each beat of the heart, Shinzo concludes, we are reminded of the miraculous gift of life that courses through our veins by embracing the practice of left-sided sleep. We honor the sacredness of the heart and nurture the very essence of our being. As the disciples reflect on Shinzo's teachings, they feel a deep sense of connection to their own hearts, recognizing them as the wellspring of love, compassion, and vitality, and as they settle into their beds that night. They do so with a newfound appreciation for the heart's embrace, a gentle reminder of the preciousness of life and the sacredness of sleep. In the tranquil ambience of the monastery hall, Shinzo's discourse on the virtues of left-sided sleep delves deeper into the intricate workings of the human body, focusing now on the often overlooked yet essential role of the spleen with a tone of reverence. Shinzo leads his disciples on a journey into the nocturnal sanctuary of this hidden organ, revealing the profound peace that can be found in the night. The Spleen Dear Disciples, is the silent guardian of our life force. Shinzo begins, his voice carrying a sense of reverence for the mysteries of the human body. Nestled quietly in the depths of our abdomen, it performs a sacred duty, purifying and invigorating the vital energies that sustain us. As the disciples listen with rapt attention, Shinzo illuminates the significance of sleeping on the left side in nurturing the spleen sanctuary. He explains how this simple act creates a conducive environment for the spleen to fulfill its vital functions, allowing bodily fluids to flow freely like pilgrims finding solace in a sacred sanctuary. When we rest on our left side, Shinzo continues, we offer a gesture of reverence to the spleen, inviting it to bask in the tranquility of the night. Bodily fluids, like messengers of peace, converge upon this hidden sanctuary nourishing and rejuvenating it with each breath we take. The disciples absorb Shinzo's teachings with a sense of wonder, realizing the profound interconnectedness between sleep position and the nurturing of the body's inner sanctum. They come to understand that sleeping on the left side is not merely a physical act, but a spiritual practice, a silent communion with the innate wisdom of the body. As we embrace the practice of left-sided sleep, Shinzo concludes, We honor the sacredness of the spleen and cultivate a deeper sense of peace within ourselves. In the stillness of the night, let us find solace in the sanctuary of our own bodies, embracing the silent rhythms that sustain us. As the disciples contemplate Shinzo's words, they feel a newfound reverence for the inner workings of their bodies, recognizing them as sacred vessels of life and vitality. And as they drift off to sleep that night, they do so with a deeper appreciation for the spleen's sanctuary, a silent refuge in the darkness, guiding them on their journey of inner peace and well-being. In the hushed ambience of the monastery, Shinzo's discourse takes a philosophical turn as he delves into the profound connection between left-sided sleep and the force of gravity. With a gentle yet commanding voice, he leads his disciples on a contemplative journey, exploring the subtle interplay between the human body and the natural world. Gravity, dear disciples, is the silent force that guides our journey through the cosmos. Shinzo begins, his words carrying the weight of centuries of wisdom. It is the unseen hand that shapes the contours of our existence, 
guiding us along the path of our destiny. As the disciples listen intently, Shinzo elucidates the significance of aligning with the gravitational pull of the Earth, particularly in the context of sleep. He explains how sleeping on the left side allows the body to harmonize with the gentle ebb and flow of this cosmic force, creating a sense of balance and alignment that transcends the physical realm. When we rest on our left side, Shinzo continues, we enter into a sacred dance with gravity, a dance of surrender and communion with the natural world, like a leaf cradled by the wind. We allow ourselves to be carried by the wind. We allow ourselves to be carried by the currents of the universe, trusting in the inherent wisdom of its flow. The disciples absorb Shinzo's teachings with a sense of awe, Realizing the profound implications of aligning with the forces of nature, they come to understand that left-sided sleep is not merely a physical act, but a spiritual practice, a conscious surrender to the rhythms of the cosmos. As we embrace the practice of left-sided sleep, Shinzo concludes, we honor the sacred bond between body and earth, aligning ourselves with the eternal dance of creation in the quiet of the night, let us find solace in the embrace of gravity, trusting in its wisdom to guide us on our journey of inner peace and harmony. As the disciples reflect on Shinzo's words, they feel a deep sense of connection with the natural world, recognizing themselves as integral participants in the cosmic dance of life. And as they drift off to sleep that night, they do so with a newfound appreciation for the subtle forces that shape their existence a silent communion with the vastness of the universe, guiding them on their path of spiritual awakening and enlightenment. In the serene ambience of the monastery, Shinzo's discourse takes a contemplative turn as he explores the delicate balance between yin and yang in the context of left-sided sleep. With a tranquil demeanor, he leads his disciples on a journey of introspection, unraveling the profound significance of this ancient practice within the framework of Taoist philosophy. Yin and Yang, dear disciples, are the fundamental forces that govern the universe. Shinzo begins, his voice resonating with a sense of reverence. They are the complementary energies that exist in perfect harmony, creating the cosmic dance of creation and transformation. As the disciples listen intently, Shinzo elucidates the concept of yin as the receptive, nurturing aspect of existence, and yang as the active, dynamic counterpart. He explains how left-sided sleep aligns with the yin principle, offering a sanctuary of quiet and stillness amidst the busyness of daily life. When we rest on our left side, Shinzo continues, we enter into the realm of yin, the realm of quiet contemplation and inner reflection. It is a sacred space where the mind can find reprieve from the ceaseless chatter of the external world, allowing for a deeper connection with the inner self. The disciples absorb Shinzo's teachings with a sense of reverence, realizing the profound wisdom embedded within the balance of yin and yang. They come to understand that left-sided sleep is not merely a physical act, but a spiritual practice a conscious alignment with the harmonious interplay of cosmic energies. As we embrace the practice of left-sided sleep, Shinso concludes, we honor the sacred balance between yin and yang, recognizing the intrinsic unity of all things. In the quiet of the left side, let us find solace in the gentle embrace of yin, allowing its nurturing energy to envelop us in a sense of inner peace and tranquility. As the disciples contemplate Shinzo's words, they feel a profound sense of harmony wash over them, resonating with the quietude of the left side. They recognize that in embracing this ancient practice, they are not only aligning with the natural rhythms of the universe, but also nurturing the balance of yin and yang within themselves, a silent communion with the essence of existence, guiding them on their journey of spiritual awakening and enlightenment. In the gentle glow of lantern light, Shinzo's teachings extend beyond the tranquil confines of the monastery, bridging the gap between ancient wisdom and modern life with a gentle smile. 
He imparts to his disciples the importance of integrating the practice of left-sided sleep into their everyday routines, offering practical insights for applying this timeless wisdom in the bustling world beyond. Dear disciples, Shinzo begins, his voice carrying a tone of gentle encouragement. The true test of wisdom lies not only in its understanding, but also in its application in the practical affairs of everyday life. As the disciples lean in attentively, Shinzo elucidates the significance of bringing awareness to the simple act of sleep, transforming it into a sacred ritual that honors the body as a temple of the soul. He speaks of the importance of creating a conducive environment for rest, free from distractions and conducive to deep rejuvenation. In the midst of life's demands and distractions, Shinzo continues, it is easy to overlook the importance of nurturing our bodies and minds through restful sleep. Yet, it is precisely in these moments of stillness that we replenish our vitality and cultivate the inner strength needed to navigate life's challenges with grace and resilience. With gentle guidance, Shinzo shares practical tips for incorporating the practice of left-sided sleep into daily life. He encourages his disciples to create a calming bedtime routine, free from electronic devices and stimulating activities, and to cultivate a sense of reverence for the sacredness of sleep. By embracing the practice of left-sided sleep, Shinzo explains, we not only honor the ancient traditions passed down through generations, but also empower ourselves to lead lives of greater balance and harmony through mindful awareness and intentional action. We can infuse each moment with the spirit of awakening, nurturing the seeds of wisdom and compassion within ourselves and others. As the disciples absorb Shinzo's teachings, they feel inspired to carry the wisdom of left-sided sleep into their daily lives. Recognizing it as a powerful tool for cultivating inner peace and resilience amidst the busyness of the modern world. With renewed determination, they commit to integrating this ancient practice into their routines, knowing that in doing so, they honor the timeless wisdom of their ancestors and pave the way for a brighter, more awakened future. In the sanctuary of the monastery, Amidst the serenity of the evening, Shinzo gently guides his disciples in the art of mindful sleeping practices, inviting them to create a sacred space for rest that honor the body, mind, and spirit. With each word, he weaves a tapestry of wisdom, offering practical insights into the transformative power of conscious sleep. Dear disciples, Shinzo begins, his voice soft yet commanding. Sleep is not merely a physiological necessity, but a sacred act that holds the potential for profound healing and renewal. By approaching sleep with mindfulness and intention, we can cultivate a deep sense of inner peace and harmony. As the disciples listen intently, Shinzo shares the importance of creating a conducive environment for rest, free from the distractions of the outside world. He speaks of the need to prepare both the body and mind for sleep, gently guiding his followers in simple yet effective techniques for relaxation and unwinding. Before retiring to bed, Shinzo advises, take a few moments to release the tensions of the day. Practice deep breathing exercises to calm the mind and soothe the nervous system. Allow yourself to let go of any worries or concerns, surrendering to the gentle embrace of sleep with gentle guidance. Shinzo leads his disciples in a series of mindfulness practices designed to cultivate a sense of inner stillness and tranquility. He encourages them to engage in gentle stretching exercises to release physical tension and promote relaxation, and to create a calming bedtime routine that signals to the body and mind that it is time to rest. By approaching sleep with mindfulness and intention, Shinzo explains, we create a sacred space for rest that nourishes the soul and restores balance to the body. Each night becomes an opportunity for inner renewal, a journey into the depths of our being where we can reconnect with our true essence. As the evening draws to a close, 
Shinzo's disciples feel a sense of peace and serenity wash over them, knowing that they hold the keys to a more restful and rejuvenating sleep, with gratitude in their hearts. They commit to practicing mindful sleeping techniques in their daily lives, knowing that in doing so, they honor the ancient wisdom of their lineage and pave the way for greater health, happiness, and spiritual awakening. In the tranquil setting of the monastery, Shinzo imparts profound teachings on the practice of cultivating awareness through conscious sleep, inviting his disciples to harness the power of this transformative practice for spiritual growth and self-discovery. Conscious sleep. Shinzo begins, his voice resonating with wisdom and compassion, is not merely about the act of sleeping itself but about cultivating a deep sense of awareness and presence in the moments leading up to sleep and throughout the night. With gentle guidance, Shinzo encourages his disciples to become fully present in the experience of sleep, inviting them to let go of the distractions of the external world and turn their attention inward. He speaks of the importance of creating a sacred space for sleep, free from the noise and clutter of everyday life where one can truly connect with the essence of their being. Before drifting off to sleep, Shinzo advises, take a few moments to pause and center yourself. Close your eyes and bring your awareness to your breath, allowing each inhalation and exhalation to guide you into a state of deep relaxation, to guide you into a state of deep relaxation. As the disciples follow Shinzo's guidance, they feel a sense of peace and serenity wash over them, as if they are being cradled in the arms of the universe itself. With each breath, they sink deeper into a state of profound stillness, surrendering to the gentle rhythms of sleep. Throughout the night, Shinzo continues, maintain a sense of awareness and presence, allowing yourself to remain open and receptive to the wisdom that arises in the quietude of sleep. Pay attention to your dreams, for they are often messages from the subconscious mind, offering insights into your deepest desires and fears. With Shinzo's teachings as their guide, the disciples embrace the practice of conscious sleep with reverence and gratitude, knowing that in doing so, they are cultivating a deeper connection to themselves and the world around them. As they drift off to sleep, they carry with them a sense of peace and inner knowing trusting in the transformative power of mindfulness to guide them on their journey of self-discovery and spiritual awakening. After Shinzo's enlightening discourse on conscious sleep, the atmosphere in the monastery's gathering hall buzzes with a palpable sense of anticipation as disciples eagerly engage in a community discussion, sharing their experiences and insights on the practice of sleep. Seated in a circle, Bathed in the soft glow of lantern light, the disciples take turns speaking, their voices hushed and reverent as they reflect on their own journey with sleep. Some share tales of restful nights filled with vivid dreams and deep insights, while others speak of the challenges they face in quieting the mind and surrendering to sleep's embrace. Amidst the exchange of stories and wisdom, a sense of camaraderie and solidarity emerges binding the disciples together in their shared pursuit of inner peace and spiritual growth. Each voice adds a unique perspective to the discussion, enriching the collective understanding of conscious sleep and its transformative potential. As the conversation unfolds, Shinzo listens intently, offering gentle guidance and encouragement to his disciples. He reminds them that the path of awakening is not always easy but that through perseverance and mindfulness. They can cultivate a deeper connection to themselves and the world around them. With Shinzo's wise counsel as their guide, the disciples continue to share openly and honestly, creating a safe and supportive space for exploration and discovery. Together, they delve into the mysteries of sleep, uncovering hidden truths and profound insights that illuminate the path to enlightenment. As the discussion draws to a close, the disciples feel a sense of gratitude and connection, knowing that they are not alone on their journey. They leave the gathering hall with renewed purpose and determination. 
inspired by the collective wisdom of their spiritual community and ready to embrace the practice of conscious sleep with open hearts and minds. As the disciples sit in rapt attention, Shinzo shifts the focus of the discussion towards the spiritual dimensions of sleep, inviting them to explore the deeper significance of their nightly rituals beyond physical health. With a serene expression, Shinzo begins to unravel the mystical veil that shrouds the act of sleeping, guiding his disciples on a journey into the realms of consciousness and spirituality. He speaks of sleep as a sacred space, a doorway to the inner realms of the soul where dreams dance and the subconscious mind whispers its secrets. Drawing upon ancient wisdom and timeless teachings, Shinzo reveals how sleep can serve as a portal to higher states of awareness, offering glimpses into the vast expanse of the spiritual realm. He explains that in the quiet of the night, when the distractions of the day fade away, the mind becomes more receptive to divine guidance and intuitive insights. As the disciples listen intently, Shinzo shares stories of mystics and sages who have traversed the landscape of dreams, communing with celestial beings and receiving profound revelations. He speaks of the dream world as a mirror, reflecting the innermost desires and fears of the soul offering guidance and healing to those who dare to venture within. With each word, Shinzo kindles a spark of curiosity and wonder in the hearts of his disciples, inspiring them to explore the depths of their own subconscious minds and unlock the hidden treasures that lie dormant within. He encourages them to approach sleep with reverence and mindfulness, recognizing it as a sacred gift bestowed upon them by the universe. As the discussion unfolds, the disciples share their own experiences of spiritual awakening and illumination during sleep. Each story a testament to the transformative power of conscious slumber. Together, they delve into the mysteries of the dream world, unraveling its enigmatic symbols and decoding its cryptic messages. In the quiet of the monastery's gathering hall, surrounded by the gentle hum of nature and the flickering light of lanterns, the disciples embark on a journey of exploration and discovery, delving deep into the spiritual dimensions of sleep. With Shinzo as their guide, they navigate the labyrinth of the subconscious mind, forging a path towards enlightenment and inner peace. In the serene ambience of the monastery's meditation hall, Shinzo continues his discourse now focusing on the profound harmony between the mind and body that can be achieved through the practice of left-sided sleep. With a gentle smile, Shinzo emphasizes the interconnectedness of mind and body, highlighting how our physical well-being is intricately linked to our mental and emotional states. He explains that left-sided sleep offers a unique opportunity to synchronize these aspects of our being fostering a state of equilibrium and balance that is essential for overall health and vitality. As Shinzo delves deeper into the topic, he elucidates how left-sided sleep can promote alignment of the body's energy centers, known as chakras, leading to a harmonious flow of life force energy throughout the entire being. He describes how lying on the left side allows the body to relax deeply, releasing tension and facilitating the free flow of preya, or vital energy, through the subtle channels of the body. Furthermore, Shinzo elaborates on the role of left-sided sleep in promoting emotional well-being, noting how the physical act of lying on the left side can have a calming effect on the nervous system. Reducing stress and anxiety, he shares insights from ancient yogic traditions which recognize the left side of the body as the receptacle of lunar energy associated with qualities such as intuition, introspection, and emotional receptivity. Through mindfulness and conscious awareness, Shinzo explains, individuals can harness the power of left-sided sleep to cultivate a deep sense of inner peace and tranquility. By aligning the body with the natural rhythms of the universe and attuning to the subtle energies that permeate all of existence, one can experience profound states of relaxation and rejuvenation during sleep. 
Drawing upon his own experiences and observations, Shinzo shares anecdotes of individuals who have experienced remarkable transformations in their physical and mental health through the practice of left-sided sleep. He recounts stories of improved sleep quality, enhanced cognitive function, and increased emotional resilience, all of which attest to the profound impact of this simple yet powerful practice. As the discussion unfolds, the disciples listen with rapt attention, absorbing Shinzo's teachings with reverence and gratitude. Inspired by his words, they vow to incorporate the practice of left-sided sleep into their daily lives, recognizing it as a potent tool for achieving harmony and balance on the journey towards enlightenment and self-realization. In the tranquil ambience of the monastery's meditation hall, Shinzo delves into the transformative potential inherent in the practice of left-sided sleep, inviting the disciples to awaken to deeper layers of self, awareness, and spiritual realization. With a serene demeanor, Shinzo elucidates how the act of lying on the left side during sleep can serve as a catalyst for profound inner transformation. He explains that this seemingly simple practice has the power to unlock dormant aspects of the psyche, facilitating a journey of self-discovery and self-realization. As Shinzo guides the disciples through an exploration of the mind's intricate landscape, he emphasizes the importance of cultivating mindfulness and awareness in every aspect of life, including sleep. He encourages them to approach the practice of left-sided sleep with a spirit of curiosity and openness, allowing themselves to surrender to the innate wisdom of the body and mind. Through gentle guidance and insightful reflections, Shinzo invites the disciples to attune to the subtle energies that flow through their being, awakening to the interconnectedness of all existence. He speaks of the inherent intelligence of the body, which communicates through sensations, feelings, and intuitions guiding individuals towards greater alignment and harmony. As the discussion unfolds, Shinzo shares wisdom from ancient spiritual traditions, illustrating how left-sided sleep has been revered as a sacred practice for millennia. He recounts tales of sages and mystics who attain profound states of realization through the practice of conscious sleep transcending the limitations of the ego and accessing higher realms of consciousness. With each word, Shinzo encourages the disciples to explore the depths of their own being, to inquire into the nature of reality, and to awaken to the limitless potential that resides within. He reminds them that true liberation comes not from external achievements or possessions, but from a deep understanding of the self and a profound connection to the source of all existence. As the discourse draws to a close, the disciples sit in silent contemplation, their hearts filled with a sense of awe and reverence for the wisdom that has been imparted, inspired by Shinzo's teachings. They vow to embark on a journey of self-discovery and spiritual growth, embracing the transformative potential of left-sided sleep as a sacred path to awakening. In the hallowed halls of the monastery, amidst the flickering glow of candles and the faint scent of incense, Shinzo pays homage to the centuries, old tradition of left-sided sleep, instilling a profound reverence for the wisdom passed down through generations. With a voice as soft as a whispering breeze, Shinzo recounts the rich tapestry of history of history woven into the fabric of this ancient practice. He traces its origins back to the dawn of civilization, when sages and seers recognize the intimate connection between body, mind, and spirit, and sought to harmonize these elements through the ritual of sleep. As Shinzo speaks, his words carry the weight of centuries of tradition, echoing the teachings of countless masters who have come before him. He shares stories of monks and mystics who guided by inner wisdom, embraced the left side as the preferred position for sleep, recognizing its profound effects on physical health, mental clarity, and spiritual awakening. 
drawing upon the timeless wisdom of the Buddha and other enlightened beings. Shinzo illuminates the deeper significance of left-sided sleep as a sacred practice imbued with spiritual meaning. He speaks of the ancient texts and scriptures that extol the virtues of this practice, describing it as a pathway to enlightenment and liberation from the cycle of suffering. As Shinzo reflects on the enduring legacy of left-sided sleep, he calls upon the disciples to honor this tradition with utmost reverence and respect. He emphasizes the importance of preserving ancient wisdom in a rapidly changing world reminding them that the teachings of the past are as relevant today as they were centuries ago. With each word, Shinzo invites the disciples to reflect on their own relationship with sleep and to consider how they might incorporate the principles of left-sided sleep into their daily lives. He encourages them to approach this practice not as a mere habit, but as a sacred ritual, a way of honoring the body, mind, and spirit with deep reverence and gratitude. As the disciples bow their heads in silent contemplation, a sense of awe and reverence fills the air, permeating every corner of the meditation hall. In this moment of profound stillness, Shinzo's words echo in their hearts, inspiring them to carry forth the torch of tradition and wisdom, illuminating the path to awakening for generations to come. In the tranquil setting of the monastery, Shinzo imparts practical wisdom to his disciples, offering invaluable guidance on how to integrate left-sided sleep into their daily routines. With a gentle smile and a knowing gaze, Shinzo begins by emphasizing the importance of setting intentions and creating a conducive environment for restful sleep. He advises the disciples to cultivate a sense of sacredness around their bedtime rituals transforming the act of sleep into a mindful practice of self-care and nourishment. Shinzo shares practical tips for creating an optimal sleep environment, including ensuring the room is cool, dark, and free from distractions. He encourages the disciples to minimize exposure to screens and artificial light before bedtime, opting instead for activities that promote relaxation and tranquility such as reading, meditation, or gentle stretching. Next, Shinzo offers guidance on cultivating healthy sleep habits, emphasizing the importance of consistency and routine. He advises the disciples to establish a regular sleep schedule, aiming for seven to eight hours of restful sleep each night by going to bed and waking up at the same time every day. The body's natural circadian rhythms are optimized, promoting deeper, more restorative sleep. Shinzo also highlights the importance of creating a comfortable sleep environment, recommending supportive bedding and a quality mattress that aligns the spine and promotes proper posture. He suggests experimenting with different sleep positions to find what feels most comfortable and supportive noting that the left side offers unique benefits for physical and mental well-being. As Shinzo concludes his teachings, he encourages the disciples to approach the practice of left-sided sleep with an open mind and a spirit of curiosity. He reminds them that sleep is a sacred opportunity for rest, renewal, and healing, a time to nourish the body, mind, and spirit on a deep level. With gratitude and reverence, the disciples bow their heads in appreciation for Shinzo's wisdom, eager to apply his teachings in their own lives. As they depart the monastery, they carry with them a newfound understanding of the profound benefits of left-sided sleep and a commitment to honoring this ancient tradition with mindfulness and intention. As the disciples absorb Shinzo's teachings on left-sided sleep, they find themselves embarking on a journey of continued exploration and self-discovery, a journey that extends far beyond the walls of the monastery and into the depths of their own inner landscapes. With Shinzo's words echoing in their minds, the disciples begin to cultivate a deeper awareness of their sleep patterns and habits, questioning long-held beliefs and assumptions about the nature of rest and rejuvenation. They approach each night with a sense of reverence and curiosity, 
eager to explore the transformative potential of left-sided sleep. Armed with practical tips and ancient wisdom, the disciples embark on a quest to nurture a lifelong journey of sleep and awakening. They experiment with creating sacred sleep environments, infusing their bedtime rituals with intention and mindfulness. They prioritize consistency and routine, establishing healthy sleep habits that support their physical, mental, and spiritual well-being. As they delve deeper into the practice of left-sided sleep, the disciples uncover new insights and revelations about the interconnectedness of mind, body, and spirit. They begin to understand sleep not merely as a biological necessity, but as a profound opportunity for growth, healing, and self-discovery with each night of restful sleep, the disciples awaken to the transformative power of this ancient practice, experiencing newfound levels of vitality, clarity, and inner peace. They recognize that sleep is not just a passive state of unconsciousness, but a dynamic process of renewal and regeneration, a sacred journey of awakening to the fullness of life. Guided by Shinzo's wisdom and their own inner knowing, the disciples embrace the path of left-sided sleep with humility and gratitude, recognizing it as a precious gift to be cherished and nurtured. They commit themselves to cultivating a lifelong practice of sleep and awakening, knowing that in doing so, they honor not only themselves, but the timeless traditions of their ancestors. As they continue on their journey, the disciples find solace and inspiration in the quiet moments of reflection that accompany the transition from wakefulness to sleep. They discover that in the stillness of the night, there lies a profound opportunity for connection, insight, and transformation, a sacred space where the boundaries between self and other begin to dissolve, and the true nature of reality is revealed. With hearts open and minds clear, the disciples embrace the journey ahead, knowing that each night brings with it the promise of new beginnings and infinite possibilities as they drift off into the peaceful embrace of sleep. They carry with them the wisdom of generations past and the hope of generations yet to come, united in the timeless journey of sleep and awakening. As Shinzo delves deeper into the benefits of left-sided sleep, he guides his disciples towards a profound understanding of the practice's spiritual dimensions. He speaks of how sleep is not merely a physical necessity, but a sacred opportunity for inner awakening and spiritual consciousness. In the quiet sanctuary of the monastery, surrounded by the gentle rustle of leaves and the soothing flow of water, Shinzo's words resonate with a deep sense of reverence and insight. His disciples listen intently, their hearts open to the wisdom that flows from his lips. Shinzo explains that sleeping on the left side allows practitioners to tap into the subtle energies of the universe, aligning their bodies with the natural rhythms of the cosmos. He describes how the left side, with its yin qualities, serves as a gateway to deeper states of consciousness inviting practitioners to explore the mysteries of the inner world. Through left-sided sleep, Shinzo teaches, practitioners can access higher realms of awareness, transcending the limitations of the ego and connecting with the essence of their true selves. He speaks of how sleep becomes a sacred journey of self-discovery, a pilgrimage into the depths of the soul. As Shinzo shares ancient teachings and profound insights, his disciples feel a profound sense of awe and wonder. They realize that sleep is not a mere suspension of consciousness, but a doorway to spiritual awakening, a sacred portal through which they can glimpse the infinite vastness of their own being. With each night of left-sided sleep, the disciples feel themselves drawn closer to the inner sanctum of their souls, they experience moments of profound clarity and insight. As the barriers of the ego dissolve and they merge with the boundless expanse of the universe, Shinzo encourages his disciples to approach sleep with mindfulness and intention, 
cultivating an attitude of reverence and gratitude for the sacred gift of rest. He teaches them to embrace each moment of sleep as an opportunity for spiritual growth and self-transformation, knowing that in the depths of the night, the soul finds its truest expression. As the disciples reflect on Shinzo's teachings, they feel a deep sense of resonance and alignment with the spiritual path. They understand that left-sided sleep is not just a physical practice, but a profound spiritual discipline, a way of honoring the divine within and awakening to the timeless wisdom of the universe. With hearts full of devotion and minds attuned to the rhythms of creation, the disciples commit themselves to the practice of left-sided sleep, knowing that through this sacred journey, they can unlock the full potential of their spiritual consciousness and experience the profound beauty of inner awakening. As the discussion on left-sided sleep continues, Shinzo transitions to the practical aspects of integrating this ancient practice into everyday life. He emphasizes the importance of bringing awareness and mindfulness into daily routines, including sleep habits, to cultivate overall well-being. In the serene ambiance of the monastery's main hall, Shinzo's disciples sit attentively, their minds receptive to his guidance. With each word, Shinzo imparts wisdom that transcends mere physical health, touching upon the holistic nature of human existence. Shinzo encourages his disciples to approach sleep not as a passive activity but as a conscious practice, an opportunity to align with the rhythms of nature and nurture and nurture the body and spirit. He suggests incorporating simple rituals into bedtime routines, such as gentle stretching, deep breathing exercises, or quiet reflection to prepare the body and mind for restorative sleep. Moreover, Shinzo emphasizes the importance of creating a conducive sleep environment. Free from distractions and disturbances, he advises his disciples to minimize exposure to artificial light and electronic devices before bedtime, opting instead for soft lighting and calming activities that promote relaxation. Shinzo also discusses the significance of maintaining a regular sleep schedule, aligning with the body's natural circadian rhythms by establishing consistent bedtime and waking times. Individuals can optimize their sleep quality and promote overall health and vitality. Furthermore, Shinzo encourages his disciples to approach sleep with gratitude and reverence, recognizing it as a precious gift to be cherished and honored. He suggests cultivating an attitude of mindfulness throughout the day, fostering awareness of the body's needs and honoring its inherent wisdom. As Shinzo concludes his teachings on bringing awareness into daily life, his disciples feel inspired to embrace the practice of left-sided sleep as a cornerstone of their holistic well-being. They understand that by cultivating healthy sleep habits and integrating mindfulness into their daily routines, they can embark on a journey towards greater vitality, clarity, and spiritual awakening with renewed determination they commit themselves to honoring the sacred gift of sleep and nurturing their inner harmony with each passing day. In the tranquil setting of the monastery, Shinzo unfolds the profound connection between sleep and the natural world, invoking the timeless wisdom inherent in the rhythms of nature. He invites his disciples to contemplate the intricate dance of the cosmos and its reflection in the patterns of sleep. Drawing inspiration from the surrounding landscape, the gentle rustle of leaves, the murmur of the nearby river, and the soft glow of moonlight filtering through the trees, Shinzo paints a vivid picture of nature's rhythmic harmony. He speaks of the ebb and flow of the tides, the changing seasons, and the eternal cycle of birth, growth, decay, and renewal. Shinzo explains how aligning with the natural cycles of day and night can enhance the quality of sleep and promote overall well-being. He encourages his disciples to embrace the serenity of the night, viewing sleep as a sacred opportunity to harmonize with the universal rhythms that govern all life. 
As Shinzo delves deeper into the concept of aligning sleep with the eternal dance of nature, he highlights the importance of attuning to the subtle cues and signals of the body. He encourages his disciples to listen to the whispers of their inner wisdom, allowing intuition to guide them in creating a sleep routine that honors their unique needs and preferences. Moreover, Shinzo emphasizes the role of mindfulness in fostering a deeper connection with the natural world. He invites his disciples to practice awareness of their surroundings, cultivating gratitude for the beauty and abundance of the earth. By grounding themselves in the present moment, they can find solace and serenity amidst the chaos of daily life. As the discussion unfolds, Shinzo's disciples feel a profound sense of awe and reverence for the wisdom of nature. They recognize that by aligning their sleep patterns with the eternal dance of the cosmos, they can tap into a source of timeless wisdom and vitality. With hearts full of gratitude, they vow to honor the sacred rhythms of sleep and awaken to the boundless beauty of the natural world. In the serene ambience of the monastery, Shinzo delves into the physical benefits of left-sided sleep, illuminating the intricate connection between sleep position and bodily function. With a gentle demeanor, he expounds upon how adopting the habit of sleeping on the left side can profoundly enhance breathing and circulation, nurturing the body's vital processes during the nocturnal hours. Shinzo begins by elucidating the natural alignment of the respiratory and circulatory systems when resting on the left side. He explains how the trachea and esophagus assume a more favorable position relative to the spine, facilitating unimpeded airflow and smooth passage of nutrients to the stomach. As disciples listen intently, they visualize the gentle curvature of the body, harmonizing with the innate rhythm of breath. With each breath, Shinzo articulates the diaphragm, the primary muscle of respiration, engages in a fluid dance, expanding and contracting with grace. Sleeping on the left side allows the diaphragm to move freely, promoting deep, unhindered breathing that nourishes every cell of the body. His words evoke a profound appreciation for the elegance of the respiratory system, underscoring the intimate relationship between breath and vitality. Furthermore, Shinzo highlights the anatomical position of the heart on the left side of the chest, a pivotal factor in promoting optimal circulation. By sleeping on the left side, he elucidates, individuals can alleviate pressure on the heart and enhance blood flow throughout the body. Disciples nod in understanding, envisioning the heart as the steadfast guardian of life, its rhythmic pulsations sustaining the body's vitality. As Shinzo continues to elucidate the physical benefits of left-sided sleep, he addresses common ailments such as acid reflux and back pain. He explains how the natural alignment of organs and the spine in this sleep position can alleviate discomfort and promote spinal health. With each explanation, disciples gain a deeper understanding of the profound impact that sleep position can have on physical well-being. With a gentle smile, Shinzo encourages his disciples to cultivate mindfulness in their sleep habits, urging them to listen to the wisdom of their bodies and make conscious choices that support health and vitality. As the discussion draws to a close, disciples feel inspired to embrace the practice of left-sided sleep, recognizing it as a powerful tool for nurturing the body and enhancing overall well-being. In the tranquil ambience of the monastery, Shinzo expounds upon the intricate relationship between sleep position and spinal health, shedding light on the profound support that left-sided sleep offers to the delicate alignment of the spine. With serene composure, he guides his disciples through a journey of understanding, revealing how the choice of sleep position can profoundly influence the comfort and integrity of the spinal column. With a gentle tone, Shinzo begins by elucidating the natural curvature of the spine and its susceptibility to stress and tension during sleep. He explains how the spine assumes a natural S-shaped curvature, with each vertebrae delicately interlocking to support the body's weight 
and facilitate movement. However, improper sleep positions can disrupt this delicate balance, leading to discomfort and spinal misalignment. Shinzo highlights the benefits of sleeping on the left side in maintaining optimal spinal alignment and comfort. He explains how the natural curvature of the spine is better supported when lying on the left side. As this position closely mimics the body's anatomical structure, disciples listen attentively, visualizing the gentle arc of the spine and the subtle adjustments that occur during sleep. Moreover, Shinzo emphasizes the role of left-sided sleep in minimizing stress on the intervertebral discs and joints, promoting a tension-free awakening. He illustrates how the spine experiences less pressure and strain when lying on the left side allowing the body to rest in a state of ease and relaxation. His words resonate with disciples who recognize the importance of nurturing spinal health for overall well-being. As Shinzo delves deeper into the intricacies of spinal support during sleep, he addresses common issues such as back pain and stiffness. He explains how adopting the habit of sleeping on the left side can alleviate these discomforts providing a supportive foundation for the spine to rest and rejuvenate. Disciples nod in agreement, recognizing the transformative potential of this simple yet powerful practice. With a gentle smile, Shinzo encourages his disciples to embrace left-sided sleep as a mindful choice that honors the body's natural alignment and promotes spinal health. He urges them to listen to the wisdom of their bodies and make conscious decisions that support comfort and vitality during sleep. As the discussion draws to a close, disciples feel inspired to integrate the practice of left-sided sleep into their nightly routine, recognizing it as a cornerstone of holistic well-being. In the culmination of his teachings on left-sided sleep, Shinzo leads his disciples through a reflective journey towards embracing this ancient practice as a gateway to holistic well-being for the body and mind. With a sense of reverence and gratitude, he imparts his final words, weaving together the threads of wisdom that have illuminated their understanding of sleep and awakening. As the flickering lanterns cast a warm glow upon the serene faces of his disciples, Shinzo begins by expressing his appreciation for their attentiveness and receptivity throughout their exploration of left-sided sleep. He acknowledges the significance of their presence in this sacred space, united in their shared quest for knowledge and enlightenment. With a gentle yet resolute demeanor, Shinzo emphasizes the transformative potential of embracing left-sided sleep as a conscious choice for nurturing body and mind. He reflects on the interconnectedness of physical health and spiritual awakening, highlighting how the practice of sleep can serve as a portal to deeper layers of self-awareness and inner peace. Drawing upon the wisdom of ancient traditions and the insights gleaned from their discussion, Shinzo invites his disciples to reflect on the profound implications of their sleep habits on their overall well, belling. He encourages them to cultivate mindfulness in their nightly routine, recognizing each moment of rest as an opportunity for healing and renewal. Moreover, Shinzo underscores the importance of integrating the principles of left-sided sleep into their daily lives, fostering a sense of harmony and balance that extends beyond the confines of the monastery. He emphasizes the need to honor the body as a sacred vessel, deserving of care and attention in every aspect of life. With a sense of conviction and purpose, Shinzo implores his disciples to carry forth the teachings of left-sided sleep with diligence and dedication, recognizing it as a timeless tradition that holds the key to unlocking the full potential of body and mind. He instills in them a sense of responsibility to honor the wisdom passed down through generations and to embody the principles of holistic living in all aspects of their lives. As the echoes of his final words linger in the air, Shinzo bows in gratitude to his disciples, acknowledging the profound journey they have undertaken together with renewed clarity and purpose. His disciples depart from the monastery, carrying with them the timeless teachings of left-sided sleep as a beacon of light on their path to awakening.
As we embark on the next steps of our individual journeys, may we carry with us the timeless wisdom of this ancient practice and continue to seek meaning, purpose, and connection in all that we do. Thank you for joining us on this enlightening exploration, and we look forward to continuing the conversation in the comments below. Until next time, may your steps be guided by intention, and may your journey be filled with peace, joy, and discovery.